<laughs> anyway, my house got broken into recently. Yes. Um, I made a vlog about it. Um, so, I mean, a lot of people were texted com- us at three in the morning. I said, text- you need to come over, which alarmed Scott and I like, oh, great. What's going to happen to us? <laughs> First, I texted the group chat and I'm like, I think there's someone in my house. You know, when bad shit happens to you now, like no one's going to believe you. What do you mean? Like you're, you're pretty young. You're very young and like nothing bad's happened to you yet. But like when crisis come to you but now, it's, but it's not like your I, friends are going to be like, yeah, right, David. But it's not like I fake this break in. You're like, there's a bear on top of me. There's a, as an alligator that bit my leg. We were like, uh huh. Oh. No, I know you didn't fake it. That's the oh, oh, thing. Oh, because you're saying everyone was. Every, all our friends came up to uh, to me. Literally, I got the so many. The closest of your friends. Yeah, like the friends that just you know. Josh Peck. That see me every day. They're like, yeah. come on, tell me the truth. Was yeah. that fake? Yeah. And it was so confusing to me. I'm like, no, it wasn't fake. I just no. I didn't understand the argument. Would have cost you seventy thousand dollars to fake that. <laughs> it would have literally cost me. So I would have been prepared with better jokes if it was, uh, you know, an sure. eighty thousand dollar gig because an ambulance came. I didn't even show up, but the fire truck was there. I was in the back, and there were like four or five police cars. Um, no, I got broken into, and it was. I, I wouldn't say broken into. Why do they into. send the fire truck always? It seems like an unnecessary send. Just to, to most times. Well, just to put out, uh, just to turn on the hose. To spray him down? No, that was, it was kind of like, it's a dirty Dom joke. He's like, you know why they call me the fireman? Why? Because I turn on the hose. Uh, it didn't land. Okay, let's no, continue. No, no, I get it. I get it. It, it landed. <laughs> um, no, but okay, so I, I, I came home. Mm-hmm. It, was, it was late. It was like 2 a.m. It was like 1, 1.45. Mm-hmm. And I see a light on. And it, uh, the second... Like, I walk by the office. The light is on in there. I assume Alex is home. He's doing something. But there's clothes all around my house, and they're not mine. And it smells awful. And then I look into the office, and it's this maybe Mexican man um, just laying on the couch, just completely Uh, asleep, just passed out out. in my clothes. It's insane. And, like, it's that's the scariest moment. There's, there's not like it's, it was, it, imagine like a scary movie, like when you're watching and you cover your eyes mm-hmm. and then something pops out, then you uncover your eyes. Cause it's already like, you know, it's happened. You're in the moment. So like, that's what happened. The only scary part of being broken into was that immediate reaction. It's like, holy shit, this guy's in my house. I'm staring at him right now. What's going to happen? Right. But like you get over it in like literally like 20 seconds. Cause you're like, okay, he's asleep. I've made some noise. I've walked around. I clicked my camera on yeah. immediately, and I thought Good he, for you. I thought he was going to think it's, it was like a gun. Mm-hmm. I was clocking, and I thought he was going to pull something out of his back and just shoot me in the face, mm-hmm. which didn't happen. Um, but but no, it, it, it turned and out. Then what did you do exactly? Because I know what I would have done in that moment. I I would have left the house. Yeah, entirely. I went. I went to the kitchen. And I, I tried <laughs> set up my camera. I tried filming an intro. Yeah, but I couldn't because I kept looking over. So I called the police. I'm like, the right thing is to call. The police. You filmed an intro before you called the police. I tried, but I couldn't. Okay. And I called and I called the police, and I'm like, there's someone in my house. Please come. And they're like, okay, on. And I hung up, put my put my phone down. Oh, because because I needed to either call the. I assumed that I was going to be on uh, with the police for a really long time, mm-hmm. so I didn't. I, I wanted to get that over with. Because I wanted to use my flashlight, like on my phone, to lighten up my face. Because I didn't want to turn on the lights in my house. Because that would have like gotten really intense, right. and the video wouldn't have been as good. Because it would have been like during the you know the lights would have been on. No one would have even been scared. Oh my god! But but yeah, I'm getting th- such a picture of how messed up we all are right now. But yeah, then, then I just did an intro. Like there's someone in my house, and like I, obviously, like this this guy wasn't gonna murder me, and I, I knew this. Video. I did a reaction video. <laughs> I yeah, I um, I played the try not to laugh challenge with him. <laughs> We had a Q and A. I really, really badly. If I would have known, my the the main reason I ended up calling the police in the first place is because I couldn't see what was in my bedroom. In my bedroom, my bedroom door was cracked open a little bit, and it was really dark inside. And just the first thing I thought of is, okay, well, if you're gonna break into my house to sleep here, why would you not sleep on my bed in my master bedroom? Mm. And I'm like, okay, well, there must be there must be four other people in the room, mm-hmm. like just sleeping on my bed, mm-hmm. just like a big group of them. Yeah. So that's why I didn't like just mess with him. That's sure. why, like, if I if I would have known it was just him, like I could easily, I, I I was easily able to tell that this guy was passed out, that he was like on some kind of drugs. He's not here, just taking a random nap. Um, and 
and like I would have, it would have been very fun to he go up to him. Just taking a random nap. I know, but I, but but not like not like sober. Like sure. it wasn't like okay, it's time for a nap. Let me find a house and I'll kill someone if they if they walk in. Got it. I could tell that he was just drunk. There was alcohol over all over the place, and if I would have had, if I would have known that it was just him, I would have loved to put, set up a tripod. Right. And or just like held the camera like and sat right by him and been like, hey. And waited. Like just been like a little smart ass. Like be like, hey, what's up? <laughs> you know, like when like a three year old like figures out something. Hey, what's up? How you doing? <laughs> Busted. <laughs> but um You're on my YouTube channel. <laughs> you're on my YouTube channel. <laughs> and and like I and then and then I had the option to press charges when the police came and I didn't want to go to court and he wasn't he, How long did it take the police to come? Um like solid eight minutes. That's pretty good. It's very good. And um yeah, and uh, I didn't want to press any charges because I didn't want to go to court. What did you say? Uh, there's an intruder in my house. There's a guy. Yeah, I said, I said there's a guy in my house. I mean, it sounded like it sounded scary. I'm like, there's a guy in my house. Please come send people. And I hung up. <laughs> <laughs> that was it. That was it. You, I hung you up. You didn't stay on the phone with them. Well, no, I gave him my address and I hung up because you didn't want to wake him. I needed to shoot, and I knew she would be. And I wanted to call Liza to show her, right? Because I know Liza wouldn't believe me, and so I wanted to show her. Um, no, but and what did she say? Get out of the house. Yeah, she was like, "Just be careful." Um, <laughs> I, I yeah yeah, but I mean, it was it was overall it was such a crazy experience being broken into. It was so surreal, and it was. Is it hard to come home here now? N- the uh, the scary part about coming home is always the like the initial thing, like the initial fear of there being something in. But after I check it out, and there's no one here, yeah. I'm good. Yeah. I w- I was scared that. It was gonna that he was maybe gonna watch it and he was gonna come back. Uh-huh. I showed Liza. I showed Liza and she felt really bad for him. Yeah, which shows what kind of a person she is. You know. Yeah. Weak. <laughs> 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 no, just, she just has like a, a heart like that where she like she's like oh he's there's obviously something wrong with him like you know he's mentally not stable like that's mm-hmm. you know because I was gonna use him as my thumbnail like his face in the in the medical chair and he's like she's like I don't know if that's the right thing to do because you could. He just, you could see like that he's completely not there. Right. And like, I understand that. But like at the same time, he broke into my house. You know what I mean? Like mm-hmm. he owes me, he <laughs> owes me a YouTube video. <laughs> like I'm not sending him to jail. Like you I don't owe- know if he owes you anything. <laughs> yeah. But, but like there's some kind of punishment. <laughs> right. And, and, th- and this punishment, I chose public embarrassment. Uh, right. Right. So that's what it was. I think that's fair. And I didn't send him to jail because, well, one, because I didn't want to go to court. And two, because it, that would be just really messed up. I think so. Yeah, I'm glad you didn't send him to jail. And and then actually the next morning I was driving out over to edit the video. Actually, two three mornings away, over uh, two two three mornings after, I was driving over to your place to edit a video, and he was sitting uh, maybe a quarter of a mile away from my house, just he's on at the, the Walgreens. Ground. Yeah, he was at the Walgreens, just sitting Why on didn't the you ground. Stop. Why didn't I stop and talk to him? Yeah. Because I needed to edit the video, and I knew it wasn't going to go in that that video. It would have had to have been a separate video. Right. But if I see him again, I'm gonna I'm gonna stop and I'm gonna do a little fun Q and A. We're looking him. for him, right? We looked for him yesterday. We looked for him yesterday because we wanted to do a question and answer, and then we wanted to give him a thousand dollars. But we figured that that may just make him want to come back. Um, but yeah, so that's my break it story. It was fun. Break being broken into was great. 